How's it going, pilots and pals alike? Ravens, Lynx, my homies, all my friends. How you doing? Let me make sure I'm not going to back out into anybody. The last thing I want to do is accidentally take a life while I'm just backing out of a parking spot. Two tons of steel, at the very least. And about ten tons of fury. Um, so, I wanted to make a video because I feel like y'all will be able to appreciate this. Uh, what I'm about to say. I want to grow the channel. I want to grow a community, I guess you could say. Which, big deal to me. Um, we're at 92 subscribers here at the Armored Core Project, which I think I'm going to switch the name to something else. It'll still be in reference to Armored, excuse me, in reference to Armored Core, but it'll be more appropriate. It'll actually be my PSN ID for whenever I'm doing um, co-op play with uh, King44 and anyone else that I can play with on there. Um, the ultimate goal here being I want to expand and do a few more things. I want to do more than just basic Armored Core videos like what I've been doing. I want to do game reviews. I want to do um, theory videos, which I can do that on Armored Core because I have a timeline theory that I like to present. Uh, I'm still going to do the videos that I've been doing. I'm still going to do the project. That is still my main focus. I just want to make sure that like I'm able to grow the channel and grow the community. That way we can possibly trick some people into thinking, oh, you know, this is going to be this kind of channel. And then they'll see like my Far Cry 3 videos or whatever of me being goofy. That was a bit of a there we go. But like they'll see me being goofy with Far Cry 3 videos and they'll be like, oh, this is this is cool. I'm going to go in here and check this dude's stuff out. And then they'll see all these Armored Core videos and be like, what is that? And, you know, the goal is to uh, trick them into becoming fans of Armored Core. It's a mischievous and nefarious means like being at least somewhat remotely funny, doing something slightly different, and then also making my project happen. Um, I'm applying for stuff. I'm trying to get a better, more suitable job with regularly scheduled hours that are consistent, not this swing crap that I'm doing now where it's a rotating schedule. Like, don't get me wrong, good people that I work with, love them. The job is bearable, the pay is decent, but I need something guaranteed set hours and then better pay and benefits also. It's going to help and I desperately need that. So, once I have that structure, then I'll have room to play because I'll be able to, like, I want to be able to do this more regularly, but without having a set day schedule that I work, like set hours and times and all that stuff, like set, set days and hours that I work, without having that, I can't guarantee consistency, and that's the problem. I have to build my life around my job, and I want my job to be worth building my life around. So consistency is key, and the goal is to be as consistently kick-ass as possible. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I want to expand. I want to broaden my horizons a little bit, do a little bit more. Um, I'm not interested in, in fancy schmancy BS. I'm going to try and just, like, the quality of stuff that you see from me now, if I can improve it a little bit, great. But for now, it'll work. It'll do. And y'all are still my primary focus. Armored Core will always be my core focus. And you see what I did there? Um, but that's my, that's my consistent and continuous goal. Stick with that and make that the ultimate focus of my channel. But I want to broaden my horizons. I want to make y'all laugh with Far Cry, with goofy Far Cry gameplay videos. And I want to have fun with it. Um, like, I don't enjoy gaming right now. I very much enjoyed getting to do some work with some people in the Armored Core community, getting to interact with and collaborate with whoever I can, whenever I can, is always fun and great, and I love it. And I enjoy what I can about Armored Core, but as far as gaming in general, I'm not enjoying myself anymore. So, but that's because of the stress and inconsistency of my schedule. So, all that stuff aside, I just wanted to let y'all know that if you see a name change, um... Oh my god, I'm doing that. Oh. 
I love that. Uh, if you see a name change after the uploading of this video, those of you who see this video upon upload, um, then what that becomes, what's that's, what that's going to become, is going to be the de facto way that it's going to be. So that will be um, the new name of the channel. The videos relating to the Armored Core Project, that is still going, they're still going to be titled the ACP, the Armored Core Project. It's just going to be that outside of that, the videos uh, outside of that will be the greater channel videos, I guess you could say. The core focus is the ACP, the Armored Core Project, and then everything else around out of that is going to be the actual channel content otherwise. That's going to be the lure to, drink, to bring them in, to get them interested in looking at the videos. And Armored Core is going to be for those fans, and hopefully to get people interested in the actual games themselves. They might, because that's the most accept, that's the most accessible game in the entire franchise, is Armored Core 4 and 4 Answer, or I should say Generation. It's 4 and 4 Answer, that's the most easily accessible. And I would say, as far as new players go, the most balanced. Because that's the one that I was able to get the most people to play that I knew, who had no experience in Armored Core otherwise. Like, like not really. Like, genuine uh, pacing and stuff like that, the, the balance of the game, they were able to pick it up very quickly, get very good at it very quickly. Um, whether that was under my tutelage or not, I don't know. It could just be aptitude for the game, but, and accessibility. But cheers to them for that. It showed me a lot that that indeed is the game that I'm glad that I'm focusing on anyway, because it's going to be the one that if I get people to play any Armored Core games, get them interested in the franchise, that's going to be the one that I'm going to need them to play first. Because despite, you know, personal favorites and stuff like that, facts are facts. That is the most access readily accessible game in the series, is Armored Core for Answer, the most balanced of the Gen 4s and it's the most easily accessible. It also tends to usually be the most abundant game out there outside of freaking Armored Core 5 and Verdict Day. Like, it's the most readily available game you can get your hands on, and usually for dirt cheap. So, bonus points on that. I just had breakfast. Um, outside of that, uh, there's not really much else to say. Look forward to different stuff just this is just the heads up update sort of thing no fancy videos no gameplay footage no that stuff this is just me me talking to y'all i'm at 92 subscribers i'm very close to 100 i didn't think i'd get this many it blows my mind every single time i get a new one absolutely love all of you you've all been a fantastic boon to my existence i love all of you i hope that you've enjoyed what i've put up so far i hope you enjoy what i put up in the future and i wouldn't be doing this without you like i really Part of me would have done, wanted to do this, but I wouldn't have done it without the community being there that is there, without the interaction that I have had, and without other channels like King44, without Rafe and Defension, without Armored Core Lore, without you all, I wouldn't be doing this. And because that love would have probably dwindled down even more, and it would just would have been like, well, I really love this, and I really want to do this, but eh. Whereas now I'm like, I've got the gear, I've got the time, I've got the willpower, let's go! Like, I'm... I'm here for it. And I've got the people who want to help me do it. I'm just, oh God. Oh, I'm so glad that Google Drive worked out. I got some stuff. You're going to enjoy some of the stuff I'm going to be doing in the future. And thank you, King44, for your assistance. You're an absolute Chad, and I love you. So glad I got to actually interact with you. I'm so glad you gave me the hand that you did. You are a fantastic pilot, and I look forward to any collaborative, collaborative work that we do in the future. As well as seeing which one of us can 1v1 and come out on top, because I'm willing to bet that I can take you. I bet I got what it takes. Unless you moonlight me to death, in which case we'll have to see how that one goes. But, <laughs> um, you wouldn't split me what I'm telling you. Um, I look forward to seeing where this goes in the future, and I appreciate each and every one of you. I love you all. Hope you have a marvelous rest of your day. If you'd like to support me monetarily, you can do so via Cash App and PayPal. Cash App is hashtag discount Walter White, all one word. I do accept Bitcoin on there, so toss a coin to your Walter, and we'll go ahead and deal with the league as, as is according to, I guess, the closed plan. Or my malicious intent, one of the two. And uh, as far as PayPal goes, if you're not a Cash App fan, um, you can go to PayPal at insoa117, that is at the at symbol, I-N-S-O-A-117, which is 13 times 9, by the way. There y'all. And um, it's my favorite number, 117 and 13. 13's technical. Um, 
I'm a Halo fan. The um, Those of you who wish to support me but would rather do so through Patreon, you can find me on Patreon at the Armored Core Project. Um, I'll have to, I guess I'll have to stick with, I don't know. I'll probably, uh, I'll have to deal, deal with that accordingly. Change the tier names and all that stuff, but do give that a revamp. I'm not a big Patreon person. I'm not really, I don't really trust the company and I don't really know how far that goes. I would much rather get it direct, uh, from you if possible via Cash App or PayPal. But if Patreon's a thing that you'd like to do, there is a Patreon. Currently it is uh, patreon.com, um, little slashy symbol. Uh, the Armored Core Project, all one word. You can find it on there. I do have tiers, so they're whatever they are. I have, like I said, I'm not really big on Patreon, but I do have it set up. There are three different tiers. I think it's three, five, and then I believe ten are the tier amounts. Um, I put like minimum effort into this. I don't know. I'm just there's a lot going on, but um, yeah, that'll get revamped. And then those of you who can't support me via monetary funds or like any kind of money or whatever, which every penny helps, and I love you for it, but and I'm so grateful, but you don't have to do that. If you can just like, share, comment, subscribe, you know, hit the bell icon to get up, to get notified whenever I upload in the future, especially with what I'm be doing later on, and keep an eye out for any new content that pops up, because I'm really looking to make y'all laugh. I really hope that you enjoy the stuff. And those of you who are new... I love you. Thank you. You're fantastic. Like I said, we're at 92 subscribers right now over here. So I'm looking to get it up to 100 because then it'll blow my mind. Oh, pfft, well, that's amazing. Let's go. And then, you know, after that, YouTube's algorithm will give me 10 bajillion subscribers out of nowhere. <sighs> Don't quote me on that. Um, But yeah, otherwise, you have a fantastic rest of your day. Hope you do well. I've got to go in here and get ready for work and God knows what else. And... I will keep y'all updated as far as anything else in the future goes. I think I have one more Reznov video uh, to work on and upload. And as I said, that's whenever I get the time to work on stuff or have the presence of mind and ability to sit for a minute and actually just do nothing, then I'll be able to do something. Um, for now, stay frosty, stay cool, and I will see y'all out there. Y'all have a marvelous rest of your day.